Today I want to give you a little walkthrough about how to create your personal developer instance right and how to request from service now so you here in the in the screenshot you can see you can use this developer.servicenow.com right so once we will type this in your browser developer.servicenow.com so this page will appear let me refresh this page so this page will be appearing so here you can see sign up and start button right so whenever you will click on this sign up and start button it will redirect you to the uh, registration page so here the registration page so just i am giving my first name last name and my email id so i am giving my password So I am confirming my password. So after that I am entering the text gg2yf. So after that you can see here radio button right. So here you can uh, read all the terms of use and you can read the privacy statement. Once you have read that, so you can click on this checkbox and uh, click on sign up. Click on the sign up. So once you will click on sign up button, this page will be appears. So service now, thank you. Please check your email for a link to access your account. All right. <coughs> So you can go to your Gmail now and open your Gmail. So So yeah, I got a mail from ServiceNow saying that welcome to the ServiceNow developer program. Please validate your email, right? So if you scroll down, you can see one button like verify email. So if you click on this verify email button, so it will redirect you other page that says, please wait, you will be redirecting automatically, right? So here uh, clearly says that your account is now active. Please click below to sign in. So I am just clicking on sign in. So here it will ask you Gmail ID. So I have provided my Gmail ID. So I have entered my password as well. And I am clicking sign in. So let me retry it. Once I have answered my details, so it will redirect to the page dollar per star service now again and it will ask you some questions here. You can just select I need a developer oriented ID. You can click on next and here one more question. What best describes your job responsibility? I can click as a developer and here you can see here in the down part I have I read and I agree to the service no developer site terms of use right you can read all the terms terms here listed in service now so once you have read, read those terms you can click on read this radio button and click on finish setup 
so now it says we are processing your request this will you only take few minutes so let's wait for a few minutes to get our instance yeah so here your instance is ready now yes so here it says your instance url and username and current password so just save your password <clears throat> so if you click on this url it will take you that service now instance yeah please note one point here so whenever you created so from from created date to from created date it will be 10 days valid for your developer instance all right if you log if you not logged into that 10 days so that automatically this instance will give you other other for other developers so make sure you have to log in at least uh, two to three days once into the development instance so that this instance see people can be used right so this is yes finally we got our development instance here our development instance and here you can see filter navigation here you can see that we have logged in as a system admin you can we, if you click this user you can see the profiles you can impersonate with this user and you can evaluate the rules and you can log out it so you can see some settings here right so these are the these are the settings which we can see if you want to search here filter navigation incident you can search for incident so here you can see all the modules under the incident create new assign to open open assign result and all right you can navigate to any modules if you want to customize it right so service now is very popular why because day by day development and it will be like uh, day by day they are uh, developing that ob functionalities and releasing it right so because of ob functionalities the service now is more popular and very comfortable to use every customer right yeah about this is all about how we can able to create the service now instance right <clears throat> thank you everyone and please like share and subscribe to my channel muttu service now learning and uh, guys happy learning